Bella, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am in a very different area for filming, but this is just a part of the lifestyle of my channel. I am just not filming on my bed today. Dolce was up all night with kennel cough, throwing up, phlegm, and he wrecked my bed, so. But I gotta film, I'm so excited for this haul. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's my life. But I have stuff from Louis Vuitton, Rode, StockX, some Revolve, just some stuff from all over the place and also Sephora. Everything that I talk about will always be linked down below for you guys to shop. But let's get into it because I'm so excited to show you guys all this stuff. I've been traveling, so I've been accumulating some stuff. Let's get into it. We're gonna start with Sephora because I love me some Sephora. They came out with their new Fairy Dust Dry Shampoo. It absorbs oil, adds volume, and extends styles. I've really been trying to get away from aerosols, especially with dry shampoo, because that's something like used directly on your scalp versus like hairspray is like on the outer. Dolce, I've gotta film, baby. He just wants to be held because he's not feeling too well. So I really am excited to try this out. I have high hope, Dolce, <laughs> buddy. I saw Emily Kaiser on TikTok talking about this and she said she loved it. And also this is apparently like six times like an actual dry shampoo aerosol. So I will try this out, let you guys know what I think, but I'm excited to try it. It came at a perfect time for me like trying to stay away from aerosols directly on my scalp. So I'm excited. House of Labs by Lady Gaga came out with a new gloss. This is the PhD Hybrid Glaze. I have the shade Macaroon and we're gonna try her out. I love glosses. I also love Lady Gaga's makeup company, so I have high hopes for this as well. It feels really nice and smooth and not too thick. I'm not sure really of all the benefits of this gloss, but I will put it up on the screen. But I love trying new gloss. Oh, it has peptide complex and prickly pear oil, so like a hydrating good gloss. Milk Makeup dropped their little jelly cheek lip stains and I was so excited to get these. I really wish I got these in PR because I love Milk Makeup, but I didn't. But I got the shade Splash for my mom and I and then I just got one shade of Burst and I'm excited to try this out. I have yet to look at them because, you know, I just wanted to be authentic and real on camera for you guys, but that's what that looks like. Oh my God, it's really like jelly. Whoa, it like jiggles. That's so cool. I will give you guys an update on how I like this, but I love Milk Makeup, I love their products, and I think I'm gonna love this. Okay, next up we're gonna move on to Louis. Guys, I'm excited for this one. <laughs> I had such a great experience in the story the other day. I will throw up photos on the screen, it was amazing. But the story behind this purchase is, I had the older version last year I bought in a video, or two years ago. They came out with a new one and my mom ended up taking my older version. So I replaced it. It's a backpack, obviously, from the shape. Honestly, I got so much use out of my other one. So this was just like a no brainer for me. I love it, very stylish. I take this to coffee shops. I travel with this all the time. So this one's a bit different because it's a lot more sturdy. It's actually the men's collection, but I really don't care. I don't see a difference, but it's got silver hardware. It's a lot bigger. It's got holders on the side for drinks. I think overall, this is definitely like, I don't know how much bigger, but it's definitely bigger. I will definitely do a comparison for you guys. That'd be a good video, but I love it. It's got the black, the silver, and I like these zippers a lot more than the gold zippers that are on like the bum bag and high rise bum bag and like the older backpack just because I feel like they're not as flimsy. But it's got two slots on the inside so you can put like your computer back here and something else and then it has so much space on the inside. So I'm excited to travel with this. It's like a full size backpack, which the other one was not. So this one's definitely a better purchase if you're looking for a good backpack. Next up we have some glasses. These were super cute. They were sitting on the table that our client advisor had for us. And I was really interested in these. I thought they were pretty cute. So different than anything in my collection. And you guys know I love sunglasses. So these are so cute. They're like pink ombre. I'm gonna try them on for you guys. Let's see. Oh my gosh, you're kidding. Those are so cute. Actually, these are like pretty reasonably uh, reasonably priced too. So I feel like these are a vibe and they're kind of like rose tinted. I love them. If you guys have seen these, let me know. But I love like the gold on the side too. 
I picked up something from Z Supply online because they had a cute Valentine's Day collection. I got this sweatshirt and it says Ciao Bella because me and my best friend Tiana have a joke with Ciao Bella because we were in Epcot at Disney and we were in Italy and I told the bartender my name and he's like Ciao Bella so he just kept saying it so now it's like just like a funny like joke between us so she'll call me like Ciao Bella and now it's always Ciao Bella and also now I, I'm dating my boyfriend and he's Italian so I feel like the only proper thing to wear in his household is this Ciao Bella sweatshirt so I love this and it's literally my name and I love Italian food I love Italian people it's like a match made in heaven and it's so soft. I talked about my new obsession with Rogue skincare in my favorites video for January and it hasn't stopped. I've now purchased everything on the Rode website except the Barrier Restore Cream. I have seriously been seeing such a difference using the glazing milk on my skin. It's so hydrated, so glowy, and so soft. So I was like, if I saw a difference with one product, imagine if I had more products. So I got a few extra. I got the new Rode Pineapple Refresh Cleanser. I am so excited to try this. I saw all the PR for it and it looked insanely amazing. Amazing. looks like this and I do want to smell it to see if it smells like pineapples I don't think it really smells like pineapples oh my god I just squirted it in my face like this in my face I don't know I don't really know <laughs> what are you laughing at over there <laughs> little dirty mine I don't really know if it smells like pineapples but I'm gonna try this I'll let you guys know how I like it I heard really good things I saw really good results on other people so I will keep you updated I also got the peptide glazing fluid. This is a dewy hydration layer. A lot of people use this before their makeup just to keep their skin looking really good. So also excited to try this. And then I got new peptide lip treatments. I have the original. No, actually I have watermelon. So I got the original, I got salted caramel, and then I have another of the watermelon. I have one package from Revolve and I haven't even opened it yet. So we're gonna open this together and see what is inside. I'm pretty sure I know what it is, but I had something else coming. So I'm not like 100% sure what got delivered first. I'm so toxic when I open boxes. I just like rip them apart. <gasps> this is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Basically, I've been wanting something from Annie Bing for the longest time ever since she's been on Revolve. And I liked a lot of the sweatsuits, but I really was waiting until I found something that was different for like my sweatshirt and hoodie collection. And this green is perfect. I love the big like college lettering on it. It's so nice and I love this sage. This is just beautiful. I only got a medium, but this is like pretty big. This is like a large in like look. So let me know if you have anything from Annie Bing. I am excited to have this and hopefully she dropped some sage sweatpants to match it. Another Louis Vuitton box to show you guys. ASMR, except I missed a nail. So fun, so great of me. I literally lost it yesterday. I have no idea where it went. Could be somewhere, it's somewhere in Tampa. That's all I know, it's in the Tampa vicinity. This is a cute little purchase. Ah! It's a mini makeup bag. So I have the bigger version, which I've done like a what's in my makeup bag video, which I'm gonna do an updated one next week, so stay tuned, or actually this week. Yeah, but for traveling, that's just too big and I just don't wear that much makeup when I travel or just in general, like I just don't have that much makeup with me. So I got this one for traveling because the other one just took up way too much space. And I also like loved the red lining on this one. So it's like the same size, same everything, except it's a lot smaller. And it's got the red interior, which I love the classic Louis Vuitton monogram print with the red interior. So excited to have this. I'm pretty sure this is called the Color Mania Collection and they had a bunch of different items from Louis Vuitton with different colors and just a bunch of different like bags and toiletry bags and duffels and it was just like outlined in different colors and the pink one was sold out but the red one was the first one that I saw that I was obsessed with so I got it and I really like it. Last but not least we have a package from StockX. I've had these for a month and a half and I just never opened them so we're gonna open them in today's video. Honestly when you travel so much and you're back for two days like the last thing on your mind is to open your packages like you just want to unpack and do laundry and sleep and get ready for your next trip so these have just been sitting here, but I ordered these such a long time ago, so I'm excited to see them in real life. These are called the Ugg Taz Slippers. They're the Heritage Braid Natural, and oh my gosh. These are stunning. Oh my gosh. These are amazing. I cannot wait to get my little toesies in these. I love these. I think they had a darker color too, but I just preferred this one. And I saw them on Revolve. They were sold out for the longest time. And I was just like, okay, I'm gonna have to get them on StockX. So that's where I got them. And I'm a huge fan of these. I have like 10 pairs of Ugg slippers. 
all I wear. I'm obsessed with them. They're great. All right, guys, that is it for this haul. I know it wasn't like the biggest one I've ever done, like my last one, which if you wanna see a bigger one, definitely go watch that. But this was definitely a lot of stuff still. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. And when you're seeing this video, oh, Oh my gosh, when you're seeing this video, my Galentine's would have already passed. It's Saturday the 10th, so I'm excited for a little Galentine's. I'm gonna have all my content on my Instagram and TikTok. My motivation of the day is to not put too much pressure on yourself, especially when you're not feeling the best and you're not feeling like the most confident. Like we all go through it. There's always days where you're not gonna feel the ultimate best, but I think it's important to remember that not every day is gonna look the same. Not every day is gonna be productive. Not every day is gonna be perfect. But if you strive every day to be the best version of yourself, those days will feel perfect. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in my very next video. Mwah. Bye. Oh, well, I'm a mess today. Love you, bye.